Hey Ranger fans, we're in for a treat today after the 10th day of fall camp with assistant head coach, equipment quarter, and director of player personnel, TJ Andrade. Coach, how was practice today? Tonight was good. I mean, we had a lot of effort. We were flying around. Um, offense looked real good. Defense is flying to the ball like we expect. Um, got out under the lights so we can get ready for Thursday against the Wachita, and that's our goal right now is to get ready for them. Good. You know, you've been with uh, Coach Walter for a long time now. You guys have worked together in many different levels throughout you know, the last couple years. This is really the first time that Coach Walter's offense is going to be put to the test with a new quarterback and a quarterback with not a lot of experience. Talk about some of the things that you've been helping Coach Walter with throughout fall camp, trying to find that guy to take the reins at the quarterback position. I think the biggest thing we've done is just teach, teach, and teach. I mean, we've got three guys that all do a great job. I mean, they got better every day. Um, they push each other. They push themselves. Um, I mean, we've taken some bruises along the way, but with breaking in a new guy, that's what you expect. But they all bounce back well. Um, one thing we do well is we try to fit what they can do, so we try and tweak things to fit each hand of what they can do and uh, just move on like that. The biggest thing is to keep teaching them, and they keep learning and moving on. Good. You know, this team, there's a lot of – There's first off, there's a lot more guys out there and physically they just look a lot more prepared for this upcoming season. What's been the one big thing that you've noticed this fall camp that maybe you didn't pick up on last fall camp? Right now I just say, I mean, Coach Doyle did a, did a great job in the off season and the summer workouts. I mean, the guys that were here, they killed it and they kind of set the tone to what we want mm -hmm. um, for them running around. I think them being here and showing what everybody, hey, I'm ready for this, let's go. Um, these guys that weren't that weren't here, or these new guys kind of got that, and they have to buy in now. And I think they've bought in. I mean, we've been conditioning, we've been running around, so they know that that what we expect. And uh, I think the biggest thing is they bought in tremendously so far on what we want, flying around on the field and doing what we expect off the field. Good. And then you also hold the title among many titles that you hold here around the Ranger football program of equipment coordinator. And I hear we've got a few new uniforms, maybe some new helmets. Talk a little bit about that and just your role as the equipment coordinator here. For Ranger Nation, uh, equipment equipment's kind of crazy. We try and do big things every year. I mean, we got a couple tricks up our sleeve this year, but we're going to bust out. Mm -hmm. um, we've got some new things, some uh, some kind of secrets we got. But everybody will see them come game day. Mm -hmm. um, you'll see some new traditional stuff, but you'll see also see that old school throwback stuff. So we're excited what we got. I hope uh, everybody enjoys it. Okay. And what are you most excited for this season? Of all the titles that you hold and all your influence around this program. What is, what is making you the most excited going into this season? I'm just ready for game one. I'm ready to get this new team on the field. Um, we got a lot to prove um, with where we're at right now, but I think we're ready to answer it. Um, the kids have stepped up. The coaches are ready. I think, I think we're ready for a kickoff game one. Good. Well, guys, if you see Coach TJ around town, on the field, around the field house, make sure you stop in and say, hi, say hey because he is the unsung hero of Ranger football. Appreciate your time. Thank you.